Hi, if you're watching this tutorial, we expect that uh, you've already seen the, the same tutorial in Visual C++. This is just a, a slideshow tutorial using what is known as a tree view and a uh, split image. So what you guys will see in the next couple of uh, maybe five to eight minutes will be the full tutorial demonstrating how this slideshow was developed using the component that I made mention of which is a split container tree view this is the tree view here and uh, a picture box okay so I will now take you into visualbasic.net and you will see how this particular program was developed so let's go into visualbasic.net now hey guys I'm just going to start a new project so unlike the previous tutorial I'm going to be using a visual basic.net right here I'm using 2008 but uh, if you guys have something um, something latest that's cool uh, at the same time the code isn't that there isn't much different within the codes anyway so I'm just gonna save this as a bb underscore node underscore slideshow Okay, so that's my slide. That is going to be the name of my slideshow that I've been developing in uh, bb.net. So my form is set. So the color, the back color, let me just give that uh, same color I used previously. And uh, font, change that to about 16. Yeah, that's cool and uh, change the font color to white the next thing I'll do is to, is to get my split image or split container sorry right there there you go so I will now reset the the undock it and I just reset it that's it. So let's move it down a little bit on dark so about that size a little bit more and take it down a little bit more. So I've now added a label up there, so I'll just change uh, the font size to something a little bit uh, larger. Maybe let's make that about 48 bold. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's it. Right, this is how my interface will look like. I have a label there that I will use as my output device and then I have uh, another output device there just like the title now I would now add a tree view let's look for a tree view that's, that's my tree view right here okay I will then dock it into frame I think how uh, maybe I'll change the background color as well let's change the background color okay now the back color change I will now add a picture frame here as a picture box click dock into parent container and the next thing will be image list let's look for an image list there we go double click on it and right there is our image list it's right there that's the image list so we will now upload the required image so the images i'm going to be using i will set the image size to about 256 by 256 then uh change the depth to 24 and choose an uh, image those are the images I intend to use so I'll just select maybe any of those images I'm fine with that okay let me go for these ones I think I have about six of those all of the images right here they are all mine developed within the uh, visual basic dot, dot net and some of the other ones are developed using flash 
you must have seen the tutorial on YouTube. Select and the first you may start from 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So click on OK. So let's go into the view tree and set the node. I don't know, the first node will be choose an image and the next node I'll make that space empty space the second one is image one or maybe slideshow one slide one let's change it to slide one slideshow one slide uh, slide one that's cool make that empty for one slide two and so on and this is how the tree view looks right now so the next thing is go straight into the code so double click into this code view and then enter the following lines of code if e e dot node dot name equals node two then picture box one dot image equals image list dot image dot images open and close that's it so all i'll just have to do now is copy and change well guys this is how the code looks right now as e.node.name equals node 2 picture frame show the following image and uh, label 2 output the following followed by the next one and next and so on so th that's the code for this uh, slideshow using a tree view and the property known as nodes it's very easy to create that shouldn't take you guys more than 20 minutes to complete so I will now take you to the environment and you see how it works okay I'm now running the program so if I click on slide one two three and so on but just for your information all of these images used belongs to me they are all developed using uh, flash and uh, some of them were developed using uh, graphics graphics method within uh, visualbasic.net so i hope uh, you all enjoyed the tutorial you all have a nice day however if you intend to send me a request uh, for the codes i'll be happy to forward it to you but please do subscribe so you all have a nice day now bye